what should be the first physical gesture for the new audience when you are on stage looking at the audience what audience is thinking about you as a predator what we observed or the kind of memory our cells has the cellular memory we are always afraid our body knows only two things survive and reproduce that is what the memory of body is now we need to defeat this memory we need to win this memory we need to be in position to go beyond that program to make them aware that we are your friends or i am your friend how to do it the audience is looking at you they have two questions whether to listen to you or whether not to listen to you now the easiest way to make them aware that you are you are their friend because they will listen to the friend and not to the enemy now how will you convey this message through your physical gesture that you are a friend to them so the first physical gesture which you need to do whenever you are in front of audience is to show your stomach area and your hands you are supposed to open your hands like this you now with the wide arm if you open your hands and you show them that you have nothing to hide there are there is nothing hidden in your hands there is nothing hidden at your stomach at stomach level if you open your hands open your palms in front of them they will immediately trust you now what is the reason what is the psychological reason so we all have got our instinct and instinct are the reflex action and those reflex action are being controlled by our reptilian brain and that reptilian brain because a reptile has the only one weakest area in his body and that weakest area in his in his body is his stomach so when you expose a stomach with the empty hand to a reptilian brain the person will start trusting you immediately so that is a first tick first physical gesture which you should be doing whenever you are in front of a audience the first physical gesture should be open your arms show them that what you have got in your arms at the stomach level then there are a few more tricks tips which you need to be doing to make that authority uh, for example you never should stand on one leg you should always be aware that you do, you should be standing on the two legs all the time if even if you are getting tired if you stand on one leg it will shift the attention it will break the energy and the audience will not pay enough attention to you then there are other things like uh, you need to make eye contact yes obviously you need to smile if it is required if it is not required you need to be in that serious mode as well so there are plenty of things regarding that another uh, another you know beneficial tip which how got a lot of results for me is how your pointers ready you know when you talk there is a chance that you might forget things so for for saving yourself from that embarrassment you should have the pointers at your hand you know a small chit in your pocket or in your hand so that you cover all the points it gives a lot of confidence i have never used my chit by the way but having that chit in my pocket give me the confidence that okay i know even if i forget i will be able to speak so that is another thing and then there are plenty of things you know uh, i don't remember right now but there are plenty of things if you ask me questions i will be able to tell you you know how how to do it how to influence people from the stage with your body language you know there are there are techniques uh, which are in swiva swaro daya there is a there is a science of left and right nostrils how to use that to influence your audience that is also there you know you can influence your audience by these using of these nostrils as well but the first thing which you need to do is open your arms and that was what the question was and thank you for answering you know plenty of people answered that question at my community and i hope that i have answered your query thank you very much for watching see you soon guys this was my promise to deliver this video today so see you soon